Hey everybody, this is Bigwigs, and we are back playing some Goddess. Let's see, last time we left off, I know, I see you. I just discovered that the mouse wheel does stuff when you move it, like this. So that's nice. And it seems as time has gone by, even as we do stuff. So, we have all the faith from our peoples, our little tiny peoples. I'm gonna collect it all. Oh, people are dying left, right, and center. Be free! I don't understand. So when people die, I figured it out that when people die, you lose belief. But their soul clearly goes to heaven. What do you want? Commandments, faith card. Okay. Hey, we got stone. That's all we got. I've also discovered something. Sorry, house. You're gonna have to go. Some more felt. Excellent. Hey, go back to your house. Nothing to see here, people. Oh yeah, build a bigger house. I should probably think about doing that, if that's even really worth it. So we've actually come to this little part here. Since for the longest time I didn't realize I could scroll around and do stuff. We've actually left ourselves with uh, quite a bit of things to do since playing this. And I really hate using the mouse wheel for things, because I have a shitty mouse. Or I have basically a mouse wheel that doesn't feel really responsive when it comes to the mouse wheel. So, yeah. If you see me like struggle with like flailing about with a camera, it's um not my fault. It's the game's fault. I'm actually entirely proficient with cameras. I say that, I've never... Video game parent, virtual cameras, your god is... Your god is good with cameras. Actually, if you see me flying around the mouse, it's just God's will. I work in mysterious ways. What are you, can I break you? You look important. We're still just farming. Um, I don't know why my own people couldn't do this. Cut down trees, but it's fine. Their god is benevolent. Their god is kind. We just want to get through this. And I'm going to keep playing. Currently, it's a bit of a waiting game. I am curious to see where this goes. I'm hoping it's becoming like some sort of civilization stuff where things just sort of explode. It seems a little bit micromanaging at the moment, but that's just because we're in the very beginning age. My people are... They're basically retarded. I'm just going to come out and say it. I think that's... That's an actual thing. Yes. Stone. Got my stone. We can move that dirt back now if we want to. Hey, bigger house. I'm going to clear out this whole area and then I'll put down a thingamajig. Oh, look, there's another chest down here I can see. No, stop, stop, stop. Don't do that. Ugh, gotta dig out even more. Timber. Hey, my construction stuff's done. I'm now more settled. It can build more permanent. I've learned how to build more permanent abodes. Cool. Whoops. The mouse will be able to do this. I wish there was a way to rebind keys for that. It's really frustrating. Oh my god, all this faith we have again. First things first. People are dying again. They'll, they'll figure it out eventually, I'm sure. We want to place a totem. Place one right there. Awesome. We'll go back to Sculpt Land. And now, I can tell people to get the fuck out of their houses. I'll give you a little bit of help, buddy. Yo. 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 I don't want too many, because like I said, yeah. if they don't have houses Yo. to live in, they die. But you know, it's understandable. I'll probably die without my house. I've destroyed this place! 
I'm sorry! Rebuild! Oh my god. And I think that'll be enough people for now. And one of the things you want your people to do is you don't want them to travel too far away. Like, this area will eventually just become a huge farm for me. Won't be able to do anything with these people themselves. Just because they're way out in the middle of fuck all nowhere. But over here, where they can build houses... I can have them do things. Like, already, that's probably... Well, it's not quite enough people. Let's see if we can just make sure they all stay nice and happy and alive. You be happy, be happy, be happy. Respect me. Your God commands it. And with that many settlers, it'll be a good start onto making the rest of this. So I will now deactivate the totem. They should all just start going buck wild. Yeah, all over the houses. That's what we want. And now, while we're waiting for them to do stuff, we can one, start doing that. Get on with our lives, basically, as a god of farming. Oh, oh. Okra. Ah, that's what they need for this. I see. There's another chest over there. Okra again? No, Timber. So it looks like these little floaty particle effect things indicate a chest nearby. Okay. Felt, more felt, always good. So basically, whenever I see these, it means, hey, you should dig here a little bit using your magicalness. So I'm just using my magicalness here. More okra, that leads to my next faith. Great. What are you going to give me? Watch you develop their civilization. What does this do? No, I don't want that. Go back. What is it? What's going on? That's what I want. I've watched you develop of your civilization and started turning your actions and behaviors into rules to live by. Commandments. The progress of civilization is a sinful ambition in thy god. Ooh. The holiest land to settle upon is that of deserts and shores. Trees must be respected and not reaped unthinkingly. I'm not liking the progress of civilization is in a sin. I don't want that. I want. <laughs> God damn it, you guys! Oh! Wooden idol. 200 belief. As a god, you are only as powerful as belief that has bestowed upon you. So this will give me 200 belief every now and then, it looks like. So my people now think I hate civilization. They think I love deserts, which I don't, to be honest. They also love trees? I'm not sure why. I thought I was a god of deforestation, basically. Eh, this won't be good. What I need to do now, I think, is I should probably ignore these people. I should focus on the expansion of these guys. And they're doing pretty good so far. They're all starting to live here now. And I'll let them grow because I don't want to mess around with moving everyone outside into the totem. And I'll start by actually connecting these huge land masses. I have tons of belief to mess around with. We'll probably widen this path a little bit. Doing some crazy shiz. There we go. That's all we really want is just a way to connect these areas. I'm not sure if this means my people won't live here now. That would suck. We're actually going to make this just a little bit staircase here for them. Because I am a kind god. I want my people to uh, experience the joys of stairs. So that either, either they always do that or it looks like you're placed randomly throughout the world. I don't think you can be placed on, like, an island. Without there being something nearby. Hmm. All oh, that comes in my domain. So we want these people to prosper just a little bit more. Actually, if you come out of your house. Yep. Yep. 
yeah, they'll run over there and they'll help out. Perfect. That's just what I want. So if we do that, will you guys run over there? No. Should we get another totem down? I feel like we should. We'll get a totem. We'll just activate the totem. You know? Get everyone's ass in gear. Everyone, worship your god. Come on. God time. Pray to me. Bless me. Do that yeah. too. One more guy. One more guy. Getting a lot of belief. The people. They're just they're like, yep, God, that's a thing. And that's wow, you know, God. Yeah, how's how's the God doing? The God's doing great today, guys. Thanks for thanks for thanks for thinking of me. We'll just deactivate the totem right now. Oh, but we just got there. Well, you know, get fucked back to work. Your God, your God demands it. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, working, working double time on those houses now. So these are the people we'll have to pull from probably to get stuff over here worked out. Um, because like I said, I don't want them to run too far, but I think here is also a good place to start to sort of building up. And we're slowly getting our population back up just by moving all the people over here. Whoa, 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 whoa! Come on, guy. We doing? Yeah, so each time one of those flags means the house is full. It also means I can summon somebody. Looks like there's a good chance some people are going to start dying off now. Um, it's not a good thing. That's like really not a good thing. So I need more houses basically to get more civilization. Kind of obviously, but at the same time, a bit of the pain in the ass is -ly. Like, I probably have enough faith to really expand these islands. Come on. Middle mouse. Hmm. These people should give me some. If you hold right click right there. Two out of four, so. Two out of five, Jesus. Those will give me something. Let's actually start by expanding these areas out some. And we will get some houses just along this beach. What's this asshole doing? Oh, he's gonna run all the way over here? Jesus, buddy. Grow bigger. Grow bigger. So, I've mentioned this before, this is still sort of like a bit of a waiting game. We're waiting for stuff to happen. But at the same time, we can we can accelerate the processes greatly. Big ol' house here! Yeah! Oh god, you guys are really tired. Ugh. Sorry. You can probably fit another house right down here, but I don't want to mess around with it too much, because it's kind of important not to. It's <clears throat> another house we can get in there. I'd like a much bigger one if we could. We get can I get a bigger house to have you? I'd be really surprised if I couldn't. Well you got another house at least. Oh bigger house, thank you. You guys are just so awesome with your bigger houses. Be happy. Oh no! Sorry. Sorry. So sorry. So sorry. My bad. Just really my bad. But they'll help with these houses, and actually these houses over here might start getting built as well. All is not lost. Far from it. Try to die, buddy. I know sitting on the beach is, is very relaxing. You know that stuff. And I really, 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 really want something that automatically does this for me. Shit! I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> yes, that's going to happen a lot. I am your I am your god. I work in a mysterious way. Shit, sorry. I destroyed your house. I did not mean to do that. This guy's just losing his shit. Oh my god, god. Yo, we can expand this main island quite a bit. 
I call it the main island. This is not the main island. That is the main island. Way off in the distance. Wait, wait, make sure these people are not just laying around doing nothing. Uh, you're all happy? Knock, knock. Knock, knock, motherfuckers. Freddy's in the house. He's gonna fuck around. I forgot when I started recording this. Actually, it was around. Probably about 20 minutes. We'll make all these probably long videos. Just so, um... Shit happens-ish in them. Like, I'd love it if people would start... Building houses and shit up here. A lot of places to build houses and shit up here. Now that I look at it. Do some of this. Oh, big house. That's what we want. The biggest of houses. It's a pretty sweet house I'm gonna make here. For all these awesome, glorious people. Look at you sons of bitches. We'll get to the next land area, the next marker. And then we'll see what that gives us. Because if it just gives us more stuff, then we'll poke around a bit. Obviously. And then once we're done poking around for a bit, we can get things. What are these, by the way? There is no shop. So this is a shop. It's the upgrade store. Um, I'm told this will also be like a free iOS version of this. So I'm pretty sure there's going to be microtransactions. I don't like microtransactions. I don't like free-to-play in general. Which is weird, because I'm a really cheap bastard. So I should really like free-to-play. But I don't. I just don't. And we're getting quite a few people. How many were you got? Holds five. That's... What about this? Full five. But whatever. More people will be living that. Five more people. And actually, by the looks of these things, if we just wait, then we will have our stuff ready. There's only three out of four people in there. Three out of five. So yeah, we'll get we'll get eight pretty easily if we just sort of sit with our hands under our asses. So I think that's what we'll do, actually. Sorry, viewers. I'm gonna wait for a few seconds. 53 minutes? Oh, okay, so it's not... It's not real time minutes, I don't think. No, look at... Yeah, it's not real time. I was about to say, that's bullshit, Peter Molyneux! You can't make me wait 53 minutes just for someone to be born. It's not like it takes hours or something elsewhere. God, you were just so tired. Yeah, yeah. yeah we got three people in on this. It's a big job. It's a big job. Whoop. Only need a few more people. Five more. Until then, we'll play a very fun game of click all the houses. But don't click them twice, because you'll be A, summon someone you will have to kill, or B, destroy the house and everyone's hopes and dreams that live inside of it. And then they'll most likely all die because there's no other real houses for them, or they'll all have to rebuild it themselves, because I can't actually build houses, even though I am an omni omnipotent god. <sighs> Two more people. Two more people. One more person. Is someone dying? Hello? Maybe I'm really close. Come on! Make babies! You'll make babies in, like, really soon. Oh, you, you, you've already had your baby making quota. 30 seconds. Except not really 30 seconds. Come on. Make me a baby. Damn it, shop icon, get the fuck out of the way! And baby! Land expansion? Nice. And now we come all the way out here. I want to know what this is. But also... What that is. Candle. Not sure what that's going to be used for. But now we have this bountiful, beautiful place. Come on. Oh, wow. I will just dig a hole here. Come on. Chess card. You are under here, right? Oh, don't tell me.
I've <laughs> Jesus Christ. That was so deep! For animals? Why? Shit. Get out of here, rocks. Fuck out of my face, rocks. Open that chest. More stone. And I think... We'll call the episode there just as we expand our stuff. And we're just sort of digging up chests. So anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. I know it's going to get... It's going to start boring. But you know what? I think this is one of those games that's going to start really slow. And then just sort of explode in my face. At least that's what I'm hoping. And it's a, it's a fairly new game, so we're interested in doing it. Thanks for like this video. Be sure to like and subscribe. And once again, thank you guys for watching. Have a nice day and goodbye. Actually, if we really wanted to be cool. I mean, if we really wanted to be cool. The Dark Hand blocks like 80% of all damage, like, including fire. I have a feeling he's doing like mostly fire damage. So let's try with the dark hand. Ceaseless discharge has given us a lot of issues.